New at 11, what's next for Union Square? The expected closure of the Macy's in San Francisco has a lot of people wondering about the future of the famous landmark. A board supervisor says there are plans in the works to reimagine the area, including a push to possibly keep Macy's around beyond this year. NBC's Pete Serratos has the details. Supervisor Aaron Peskin tells me tonight that discussions are taking place to hopefully keep Macy's in San Francisco, but he says it's a part of a much larger plan to revitalize the area. We are actually in active discussions with uh, people who are high up in the Macy's organization uh, at the national level and seeing if they'll spare San Francisco. And it's why San Francisco Board Supervisor Aaron Peskin is staying optimistic about keeping the doors open at the Macy's store in Union Square. The retail giant announcing last month that it was closing 150 stores nationwide, including the Union Square location. We have sent our highest level people to their highest level people, so fingers crossed. But the future of Macy's isn't impacting the future plans for Union Square, which Peskin says could include converting empty office space to housing, a cable car museum, and even a main stage for performances as early as this summer. We are working on getting money in this coming year's budget to activate Union Square with everything from music to dance uh, almost every day. Tenants come, they move, they relocate. During a panel discussion at Manny's in San Francisco, development experts shared their thoughts on the opportunities for the Macy's building should the closure go as planned. I think that's one of the things that's going to be really important is activation and getting different types of uses. We really just want to open that building up and have something that's amazing that actually has nothing, probably will look nothing like Macy's. And with uncertainty surrounding the official end date for Macy's in the city, Peskin says the city will push forward with ideas to reimagine Union Square. Part of, I think, our mission is to make Union Square more of a neighborhood. And when you have more of a 24-hour place, I mean, Union Square hasn't been a 24-hour place. In San Francisco, Pete Serratos, NBC Barrier News.